Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Heather and today we are going to be opening another Fab Fit Fun box for the fall 2020 season. I am really, really excited because I've actually had this box sitting here for a while. I normally open it right away because I cannot wait. I love my Fab Fit Fun box, but it has been a really crazy month and we're getting ready to move very soon. So things are just in a bit of disarray at the moment. Welcome to 2020, right? So um, anyway, finally getting to open this. If you're new to the channel, I do lots of lifestyle content, especially unboxings, fashion, and fitness. So definitely consider hitting the subscribe button and turning those notification bells on so that you are notified when I upload new content. Now, FabFitFun is a lifestyle subscription box and it's like $50, I think, every quarter. So if you love a variety of skincare, um, you know, clothing items, anything in that realm, makeup, it's usually kind of all mixed in. So I love the variety and I love the value on this box. This is the first time that I have gotten a box on the sort of, I don't know what it's technically called, but like the premiere window. Basically every month you get a window where you get to select a few items from lists so that you have some items you chose and some items that are a surprise. And normally I am not on that first window of choosing so this is the first time i have been and i'm really really happy about it and i was so excited to get to see all of the options so i don't remember everything that i chose and again there are always surprises but let's see what is in this fall box i love the artwork although as you can see it was a little bit destroyed by the postal service who stuck the giant label right over the beautiful box so it is what it is but i wish they wouldn't do that let's dive in and see what's in this fall box if i can figure out where to open it i need scissors all right so on the inside we do have again just sort of this brown cardboard with this fall yellow kind of a mustard yellow in this um leafy floral print it says fab fit fun and we just have <laughs> this kind of covering it um all right on the inside we do have the magazine that talks about i believe all of the options for the items in the box i always forget to look at this after i open but i never want to spoil anything for myself so i'm going to set it aside also on the top they always include a bunch of coupons so we have a coupon to a wine subscription and to hellofresh which we already get uh periodically we really do like hellofresh and let's see then this says basically to pass a $15 off coupon to someone who wants to try FabFitFun. So this is always nice to have these little extras. Okay, so the first thing I see on the top, I don't remember specifying, maybe I did, but I don't think so. Um, this was probably one of the items that was not an option, but we do have a natural hair oil. Um, I think the brand is called Liquid RX. I think that's what it says. I'll give you a close up here in a second. But it says it is a stress reliever, 100% natural hair oil. So here is a close up on the bottle. It is an eyedropper style. And right there, I think is what it says, Liquid RX, I think on the top, stress relief. Okay, let me see. Let me see if there's any kind of scent I can identify here. Okay, don't get me wrong. I don't dislike it. I don't love the scent. It has a little bit of like a medicine-y undertone to it. You know when uh, it's almost like a sharpness? I don't know if that makes any sense. Maybe it'll be different when I actually get it out of the bottle. But um, I do like that it's for stress relief. I think that's really cool. I will definitely give it a try. I really love that the bottle is like weighty and glass. I love when they feel kind of expensive when the bottles do. So I will definitely give this a try. But like I said, probably not my favorite scent I've ever smelled. It's not horrible. It's just kind of... Um, I don't know, I like when something smells yummy, you know? So um, it's all right, we'll give it a try. Okay, so the next item in the box, I totally like read this wrong a second ago. I thought this was for your face, okay? It is not. Um, it is a crease release, the laundress. It just said removes wrinkles and I was thinking, oh, perfect, let's put it on my skin. It is for clothing and fabric, not your face. Um, but basically you are going to spray from six inches away and it's safe for all fabrics and furnishings. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I'm not a furnishing last time I checked, but it is called crease release classic. This will definitely come in handy because sometimes in the chaos of life or certain fabrics that are a little bit tougher, they do tend to crease more easily. So I will definitely give this a try and it is something I don't have. So I am actually really excited about this not for your face product. Here's a close up on the bottle. It's just a very clean looking bottle. You can see it does kind of look like a facial care 
bottle, which is why I just saw the removes wrinkles and <laughs> got excited for a different reason. But anyway, this is a really cool product and I can't wait to try it. Okay, so the next item I am really excited about, I believe it's going to be a piece of jewelry and I do think I picked this out, but I don't remember entirely what it was. But it is by a brand called Jenny Bird. You can see it's on this nice sort of velour um, drawstring bag here. And I really, really like that. So we do have this nice silver pendant style necklace. I do remember this now. I just thought it was really, really pretty and simple. It is two layered, I believe. Um, I think I'm a little bit tangled up here right now, so I'll have to try it on, but I think this is just a really stunning classic piece, which is what I like about it. It says meet your new favorite jewelry brand. It gives a lot of her information, so if I can remember, I will put a link to her jewelry brand down in the description as well, and it is wrapped very nicely to keep it protected, so it is like a solid silver on that pendant. It is really, really pretty, and I do love classic and elegant, so I am excited to wear this. Okay, so the next item is in a really, really cute package, and it is called Glow Milk. It's in a little milk carton type of container, and it says it's by The Beauty Crop, nourished with coconut and argan oil, illuminating milk for face and body. So. It is liquid radiance in a bottle. Create a long lasting lit from within look with our champagne colored liquid highlighter. Yes, I love a highlighter. Um, I don't know what tone this is. I guess I'm actually supposed to open this, right? Yes, there is a little spot on the back you have to cut. I'm gonna see if we can actually see what's on the inside of this package here. I'm really excited about this because it is this beautiful rose gold color. I really, really like this. What is so great about this, in my opinion, is those rose gold shades kind of pull gold and silver into the tone. So it ends up being a color that works on a lot of different skin types. And it's also sort of a middle of the road shade in terms of not being super light or super dark. So what is great is this is gonna work for a lot of people and it's such a pretty color. So really, really love this. Okay, the next item in here I think was something else I chose, which really wasn't something that I needed, <laughs> but um, I just always get excited about these. And it is going to be basically a water bottle. It's a mason jar style. It says mason jar hydration kit. So it's going to be, I believe, let me just pull it out of here. It's by Mason Tops. Yes, so it's basically a glass bottle that is protected by an outer shell. Now, I, for some reason I was thinking this was gonna be rubber, but it is more of like what you would find on, what are they called? Like the koozies, it's kind of that material. I don't know what, <laughs> what that is actually, I can't think right now, but um, it's in this nice teal and it's reusable. It's got this great wide top, which I absolutely love. I do love to work out, so I can never have too many water bottles. So this is really, really great. And I do love that it's kind of eco-friendly being a reusable glass bottle. Absolutely love that. So even though I do have a lot of bottles, I thought, why not one more? I love these and I love glass bottles as well. So definitely a win. We've got, I think, three more items in here. Let's see, this is called Height Tranquility Sleep Mist. I'm already gonna like this, I can already tell you. So I'm assuming this is something you kind of spray in the room to help you sleep. Formulated with powerful ingredients that relax your senses and soothe your skin, this calming lavender scented mist, yes, lavender is really good for sleep. Uh, it creates a tranquil sleep environment while promoting a healthy complexion. I'm gonna have to read a little bit more about this, but I already know that it is going to be lavender scented, which I love, it definitely is relaxing. And if you are new here or new to, I actually have another channel that's Disney based as well, so I know some of you know this about me, but um, I did used to be a flight attendant for five years and one of the hotels we used to stay at had a little like scented room spray for sleep. And I used to keep it because it was like a little personal one they give you as part of a welcome gift sort of thing. And I used to bring them home all the time. I think I still have some stocked up and I use it sometimes. So um, that's what I think this is gonna be like. Oh, it smells so good. This smells amazing. Um, this smells so much like the one from the hotel actually. So I already know that I love this. Okay, it does say on here to mist around your pillows and sheets. So uh, it says hold eight to 10 inches away from your face and body to relax and soothe skin. So I guess you can use it on your skin or kind of around your bed, over the bed. So this is going to be very versatile. Lavender's amazing and this was a score product for me. 
This might be one of my favorite things in the box so far. The second to last item here is called Glossmetics Hair Removal Device. This device will instantly and painlessly sweep away unwanted hair from any area of your body. It's discreet and portable. Design takes AA batteries. I kind of remember looking at this. I don't know if I chose this or not. I'm not sure, but uh, I want to take a look at it. I am intrigued to see what this looks like. Here we have this little device in kind of this rose gold. It looks like a cigar to me. <laughs> it looks like a cigar. I don't know. Um, but it does, let's see, it, it, I guess it needs, it ha comes with a battery actually. So that's nice that they give you the battery. I hate when you have to go buy batteries immediately. But yeah, I mean, it is discreet. It kind of reminds me, does anyone know what epiladies are? My mom used to have those growing up from like back um, in, I don't know when those were, pop were popular necessarily, but that's kind of what it looks like on the bottom. So I don't know if it's going to be like a mini version of that. Uh, again, I'll have to keep you posted. I think I might have picked this because I was kind of intrigued by it, but um, I'm always a little scared of stuff like this. I will definitely give it a try. And yeah, um, I will keep you guys posted if you want to know down in the comments. All right. And the last item in the box, I know I chose for a fact, it is by a company called, I don't know if it's like a French pronunciation, like Botkier or if it's Botkier. Like, I'm not really sure how to pronounce this. If someone knows, please let me know, but it is New York and it is a little purse slash backpack. So we've got kind of this faux leather paneling covering um, the main part of the bag. We've got some zipper panels in the front and we do have these uh, straps in the back that have their name along them. It's really nice that it's subtle because it is in that black. I don't like things that have crazy labeling going on. So I really do like that. We have a little snap front, a nice deep set uh, pouch on the bag here. I'm trying to see if there's anything else in it. There's kind of like on the bottom, this is going to sound like a weird reference, but there's a, it's got a very stiff bottom that I'm trying to work out right now underneath like it will flatten out kind of like a suitcase does that make sense how some suitcases have that or some duffel bags that's kind of what it reminds me of that structured bottom that has a little bit of give to it so i'll have to work that out i do like that the material seems like it would be nice in not the greatest weather it kind of has that windbreakery texture now obviously not as much on this part but overall it would be a good kind of all-weather bag i don't have a lot of simple black bags now i will say that I do notice I have a little scuff kind of on the top of my bag here. I don't know if you can see that. And I did also notice that I have a thread coming out kind of along the zipper. I know that's relatively minor here as well coming up. I just always worry when I see things like that right away if it's going to be well made. Um, I hate to say that because I really like the style of the bag a lot. It's very versatile. Um, but that's just my two cents. I always get a little nervous when I see that right off of the bat. That is the last item in the box. I did overall really like the box. I have never been like disappointed with a FabFitFun box because it's $50 and look at the amount of stuff in here. I know that my value has got to be way higher than that. And I believe the booklet will tell you, but, um, a lot of times you'll have an item that's practically $50 new by itself. So they do a really excellent job on the value. I am as excited about that room spray as anything else, as weird as that sounds, because I have not known where to find something similar to that. And I knew one of these days I'm going to need to. So chat with me down below. Let me know what you think of this box and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.